a work by this man, discusses killing livestock solely for their skins and refers to observations on wool prices made by David Hume. This man was opposed to slavery because he thought paying for labor up front to be a risky investment. This man's works in moral philosophy include the theory of moral sentiments, and his most famous work in economics claims that it is not from benevolence that people conduct business, but in regard to their own interest, introducing the idea of the invisible hand. For 10 points, name this Scottish economist and philosopher who published The Wealth of Nations. And the answer is Adam Smith. This man described a scenario in which a helicopter suddenly drops a bunch of money to propose an alternative to quantitative easing. This man's K% percent rule advocates for increasing the money supply by a set amount each year. A book by this man and Anna Schwartz blamed the introduction of the gold standard for causing the long depression of the 1870s. This man stated that inflation is always and everywhere a monetary phenomenon. For 10 points, name this Nobel laureate who wrote Capitalism and Freedom and who was a member of the Chicago School of Economics. And the answer is Milton Friedman. This thinker illustrated one concept by contrasting the architect who raises his structure and imagination before he erects it in reality with the bee. One of this philosopher's ideas was recast in terms of property relations in a 1982 book by John Romer. This thinker argued that social stratification leads agents to become estranged from their species being and that by acting on the physical world, individuals experience objectification. This author of the Grundris gave an account of exploitation based on the expropriation of surplus value and argued that in the capitalist mode of production, workers are alienated from the products of their labor. For 10 points, name this German author of Das Kapital. And the answer is Karl Marx. A work by this thinker introduced a concept known as liquidity preference. This thinker proposed a hypothetical beauty contest to describe rational agents in a market. This thinker, whose ideas were summarized in John Hicks' IS-LM model, described the Treaty of Versailles as a Carthaginian peace in his Economic Consequences of Peace. In another work, he argued for increased government spending to curb the Great Depression. For 10 points, name this British economist and author of the general theory of employment, interest, and money. And the answer is John Maynard Keynes. This economist wrote, a fall of wages would have no other effect than to raise profits. A law ascribed to this economist states, the rent of land is determined by the excess of its production over that which the same application can secure from the least productive land in use. This person described his ideas on rent in the principles of political economy and taxation. This person used the example of cloth and wine production in Portugal and England to explain the benefits of free trade. For 10 points, name this early 19th century British economist who developed the theory of comparative advantage. And the answer is David Ricardo. This economist was awarded the Presidential Medal of Freedom in 1946 and in 2000. In one of his works, he questioned the competitive ideal in industrial corporations, and in another work, he criticized the American wealth gap. This Canadian-born economist also worked as an ambassador to India during the Kennedy administration. For 10 points, name this economist who wrote The New Industrial State and the Affluent Society. And the answer is John Kenneth Galbraith. 
This man divided humans into a productive class, a proprietary class, and a sterile class. This man's tableau économique was initially published under the pseudonym of the Marquis de Mirabeau. He argued for the replacement of the tally with a flat tax on landowners and founded a school that argued that a nation's net product was entirely in agriculture. For 10 points, name this leader of the physiocrats. And the answer is Francois Quesnay. This thinker described how the co-location of factories helps create positive externalities via what he called an industrial atmosphere. This thinker developed the earliest version of the quantity theory of the Cambridge equation, describing a quantity theory of money. This author of industry and trade called Henry Sidgwick his spiritual mother, and Sidgwick, in return, was influenced by his the economics of industry. This economist's most famous book made the first major use of graphs to display what he likened to scissors that determine price, the supply and demand curves. Utility curves for a given fixed level of income determine this economist's namesake demand function. For years, the dominant economics textbook in Britain was this author's Principles of Economics. For 10 points, Hicksian demand is contrasted with the form of demand named for what economist? And the answer is Alfred Marshall. This man compared the role of women being taken as trophies by barbarians to women who were stay-at-home housewives. In an 1899 book, this author claimed that things like sports and going to church were wastes of time and resources that were meant to show off the status of the middle class. He coined the phrase, conspicuous consumption. For 10 points, name this Norwegian-American sociologist the author of the theory of the leisure class. And the answer is Thorstein Veblen. Gottlob Frigga ridiculed this writer by saying that he relied on pebble and gingerbread arithmetic. This person used the method of concomitant variation and the method of residues as two of his five methods to determine causation. In another book, this person wrote, He who knows only his own side of the case knows little of that. In that book, this person argued that power should only be used to prevent harm. In another book, this person argued, only happiness is a good to each individual and in the aggregate to all persons. Name this person who wrote A System of Logic, On Liberty, and Utilitarianism. And the answer is John Stuart Mill. (laughs) 